My name is Russell Kirk and I'm a performer, composer, recording artist for Inner Circle Music. I've titled this new album The Path to Journal Square. It comes from all the twists and turns, basically the path that led me to New York, this music, the musicians on the recording. The process of writing this music um, actually started before I came to New York and this motive kept creeping into my practicing. This riff would just keep coming in. It's boo -da -ba, boo -do -da -ba, boo -do -ba, boo -do -ba. And it just, it kind of brought on a life of its own and uh, before I knew it I had composed an entire suite of music. I got inspiration from all over the place, including my family and you know the birth of my son. All of this was just encapsulated into this recording. Another huge part of the compositional process is writing for the musicians that are inevitably going to perform this music. I mean, your, your band is your sound and your band is your soul. It takes certain people for you to be able to release this. When you're writing for these people, it just, everything just starts to flow. Wayne Krantz, after hearing Wayne play in my charts, uh, his sound was forever ingrained in my head. He has such a distinct approach to the guitar, it guided my music. Terry Lynn Carrington. She brings a whole other level of music to the table. This music is the sound of my soul. I'm, I'm writing this because it's what I believe to be my unique voice. And Terry Lynn, she feels all that. I don't want to stop playing when I'm with her. Arwan Ortiz, um, the way Arwan plays, it's just human. It's natural, free. As a soloist, he, he does exactly what he's supposed to do. He also gave me the creative push to continue. Um, it's, it's always a conversation when I play with Arwan. Jacob Yaffe. Um, we have very similar influences and backgrounds. Being in this new city, constantly talking about music, um, composition, improvisation, everything. Your sounds are so similar, there are times when you actually can't tell us apart. Ed Howard on bass. Ed is a rock um, with all that feel and all that groove. He is no stranger to complicated music and he's just been great to work with. Sonya Kitchell, she brings a powerful um, presence to the bandstand. You can feel this this vibe just coming out of her. It's, it's like she's in the zone and when she's in the zone it helps me get in the zone. You know when you actually sit down to write music that tries to represent your soul, um, this is what that is and, and it's art music. Some of these tracks are they're complicated, they're filled with timbres and sounds and rhythmic changes and band shifts in and out of different feels and grooves. That is the sound that's truly inside. This is what I'm hearing in my head when I'm thinking, what do I want my artistic statement to be? The Path to Journal Square is artistic music. This is my soul being released and presented to you in a raw form.